Hello there YouTube viewers, in this video I'm going to show you how to use any capture card and capture videos on your computer in standard definition, not HD, but that's still okay if you want to send some bug reports or reports to game developers. So what you are going to need is a computer, any computer, laptop it can be. You're going to need your cables. Cables, it doesn't matter which ones you have, if you have an HD capture card, use HD cables. And last, you're going to need your gaming consoles cables. Right here I have standard definition Xbox cables. Um, this, I, I do have an HD capture card, but that's not for uh, this tutorial. So let's get to the building. Okay, first thing you're going to need to do for this is identify the output and then here it, there's the input cables input and output you're going to plug in your gaming consoles cables here like that now here you are going to plug in sorry I'm taking too much that much time here are your USB cable these are the expensive ones and now you are going to plug in here your other cables so basically this is going to be like an adapter like that So this cable, this USB cable, you plug into your computer through their USB jack. Now this Xbox or this gaming console's cable, you plug into your gaming console back here, which is my Xbox 360. Now these cables you are going to plug into your TV. And now, I have one of these new TVs, and sometimes on the side you have these inputs, or back the, here in the middle, you have inputs. I'm going to plug in right here on this side because it is easier for me to get. And this is temporarily. I'm just going to be testing this out. There, they are all plugged in. I'm going to turn my TV on right now. There. I'm going to set my television's input right here to audio visual 2. Now I'm going to go ahead and turn on my Xbox 360. There. Now it is running, my Xbox 360. Not literally running, <laughs> but it's currently functioning. It's on. Now I'm going to turn on this program that I have, the link in the description. Here you should have your program running. Now I would have the default has the camera from the laptop. Here you go to click devices and pinnacle. That pinnacle it selects your Xbox 360 or gaming console. And it has the gaming console up there on the screen so that here I can play a game right now while I have it streaming through the computer. Now I don't want to play this game for real. So I'm just going to click exit out to this Xbox dashboard. Now there we have the video, but what, how, how do we save these video clips that we have? What you are going to have to do, go back to this video view, video view application, application click set capture file, 
Now what you do, you go desktop and then type in Xbox 360. That is going to be my AVI file. And now capture file size. You are going to have to guess how long you want it to be. I'm going to put five, 501 megabytes. Okay. And it's now taking some time to make create this file. And after it creates this file, you... <laughs> After it creates this file, you click Capture, and then click Start Capture, and you click OK. Now it is recording what I see on this television screen, right up here. And I am just going to make a test. Okay, so now here I am recording this all including the sound which is good